Okay, well, I learned my lesson. I'm, I'm done with that. I'm never gonna, never doing another one of those. I'm sorry. I apologize greatly to you if you want to see it, but you're gonna have to watch somebody else's because I'd rather not kill myself. <laughs> I'd really rather not. <laughs> so stupid. Why? Why was that put in the game? Thank you. I'm actually back to playing Assassin's Creed. Holy shit. Holy shitty shit shit. Ugh. So, so bad. So bad. What a poor decision. Alright. So anyway. How the fuck did I get out of here? How did I get... I, wa I walked into the door. I think there's, there should be a Master Assassin mission somewhere, right? Because I... I got another Assassin high enough, right? To level... I guess I haven't taken over the, the two other Templar dens yet, so I can't. So I don't think any of my dens can now be attacked. Because I have assassins there. But anyway, let me let me I'm gonna go there. Because my assassins returned and a bunch of them got promoted. Blacksmith, Let's see if they have some more armor. Let's see if they have some better armor. Yep, they sure do. I can definitely afford them. What weapons could he possibly have that are better than mine? Yeah, no. Oh, I guess mine's not technically not the best best weapon, because although it's it's certainly the best weapon compared to these, it's all suck. Refer me to your friends, eh? No, fuck you. <laughs> no. All right. Chest. Damn it, I said I wasn't gonna look in any more chests. That's exactly why. No money, just bomb ingredients. How I'm not completely full on every single bomb ingredient is beyond my comprehension. Because by all means, I should be. <laughs> I really should be. Assassins maxed out. They are. Yeah, they all are. All my assassins are maxed out as far as. As far as, uh, upgrades go. Well, let me go, because I think, like I said, I can assign one of my assassins to a new den now. And once I did do that, I'll send them out. At least I'm pretty sure I can do that now. See if they tell me where. 
Or if all my gems are secure, like I said, they might be. Oh, they are. All the dens are secured. I can't put a new assassin anywhere. All the dens that I had taken all have assassins. I guess. Hmm. Yeah, I guess, I guess you just put them where the Templar dens were. I guess all the assassin dens that were already yours, you don't you don't need to put people at. Aha, I have a guy that's ready to be a master assassin. This assassin is trained to become a master assassin. Okay. Mediterranean defense. Can I just put all of them to reclaim the city? Doesn't look that hard. If I just put these two, they'll do it. Wait, hold on. I messed up. Can the rest of my guys handle this? Probably not. They'll all get 375 experience. Here we go. She'll get 454 experience. If, I, if it is a she, I don't know. She'll rank up to assassin. Okay. I got those guys out, everything's looking good. So I, now, I guess, I will do the main story. How far away is it? It's not far at all. I'm going right toward it. Ooh, still have a bad taste in my mouth from that. <laughs> from that first person platforming. I still have a bad taste. Uh, just, just mind boggling why they uh, did that. I mean, I guess they're trying to change it up, but that is not the way. First person platforming is some of the most annoying gameplay you could possibly have, in my opinion. That's why they don't make really first person platformers that, you know, at least none that I've ever heard of that were any good. Because when you have first person, you cannot see if you're about to fall off something. You cannot. That's why this game is third person. You know? You cannot see how close you are to falling off a ledge or, you know, any of that stuff in first person. Oh, Jess. I will play you for your coat. A colorful coat. That's not a legal move. That is a European variation. Aroko. Castle. It's interesting, but not exactly fair when you play by different rules than your opponent. You may think differently when you are Sultan. Shall I take it back? Huh. Suleiman. I know it has been hard on you watching your father and me quarrel over Beazid's throne. Grandfather has chosen you, and his word is common. What is there to argue about? Your father and I were close once, but his cruelty and ambition have made... I have heard the rumors of you. <laughs> well, I have a meeting with the vizier soon. Shall we continue another time? Whenever you like. Tarek has been selling guns to a local miser, Manuel Paleo Logos. Paleo Logos? That is a sad sound. The last Byzantine emperor was Constantine Paleologos. 
The Vizier is arming a militia of some kind. This conflict will escalate. You know it. Tarek knows where the rifles are headed. If I find him first, I can follow the weapons straight to the Bitson teams. He would be with his Genesis in their barracks. So if you want to get close, you will have to be one yourself. Ah, going on cover again, huh? Don't take the time. Giselle. Get the information you need. Then kill him. Whoa! Are you sure? You told me Tarek and your father were close friends, Suleiman. This is true, but such naked treason against my grandfather deserves death. Huh. In Daisy. So I'm gonna kill I'm gonna kill the leader of the Janissaries. I'm gonna kill Tarek. Although I don't personally trust Suleiman, to be honest with you. He seems a little shady. Ezio wants to interrogate Tarek Barletti for the location of the Templar army. To get close to Tarek, acquire a Janissary disguise. I don't necessarily trust Solomon, like I said, because I think he wants his father to be. to be, uh. Sultan. So, I think he. I think he has his own agenda. I guess we shall see. Maybe he is trustworthy, who knows. We won't know until... Until later, but I just have a sneaking suspicion about him. <laughs> no, not another data fragment. Don't want it. Take it back. I don't ever want to see another data fragment again. <laughs> 